hello everyone this video i will show you how to store value in the local storage and also get the value from the local storage okay in react let's start i already created a react project here now i'm going to create a input field and also i'm going to create a button i need to close this and give it as a add as a button name and i'm going to get the value from the input by using a ref okay first i need to create a initial ref its name is data data and this is use ref yeah it's imported here okay and i need to okay i'm going to copying this data and paste it inside the input field okay now i can able to get the value from this data okay first i need to create a on click and this is and it will click okay and copy this on click function name and create on click function and uh, initially i will show you the value of the input okay this is okay this is initial value first i save this file and going this is the UI of this and save this file and I'm going to sorry I refresh this page now I'm going to click inspect open a console if I type anything in this input field and I click add button means it will give a value as oh sorry I need to add data dot current dot value and save this and again I refresh this browser and I type something and click add button yeah our value is printed here okay now I'm going to store this value in the local storage now I'm going to create a local storage dot set item and I'm going to give initially initial value of this okay here I give a input value this is the variable name and I'm going to pass this data dot current dot value input field value into the local storage and I save this if I refresh this page if I type ABC and click first I will show you go to application and this is here you click local storage and click this button this triangle okay and click HTTP local source 3000 this port, this location okay this URL okay initially it's empty if I click add button it will create a input value and its value is ABC okay now I'm going to get this ABC and console okay after this I'm going to create one console log and I'm going to get the value from the local storage and local storage dot get item and its variable name okay variable name is input value copy that and paste it here okay and it, I give a uh, identification okay I give it as a star okay save this and I'm going to the console if I refresh this page I already insert a value okay so I get ABC if I type something okay something and click add means it will Apple is added in the application and local storage okay the input value is Apple ABC changed it to Apple if you refresh this page and I, I go to console and refresh this page I get Apple okay you can use a local storage for uh, uh, login login page you can store the login credential in the local storage uh, whether the user is already exist already logged in or a new user okay you can identify like that okay this is what i try to tell in this video thank you i will see you in next video bye bye